Cool! There's a new movie out. We should take Mikey to the movies. Hey, you! I finally got you! You can't run away now! Whoa, whoa! Man, be cool. What's up? Why did you set my house on fire? Where am I supposed to live now? I'm sorry your house is on fire, but what makes you think I set it on fire? I saw you set it on fire myself! You're not getting off that easy now. Leave me alone, man. It wasn't me. Who? Oh my god, is he out of his mind? Why would my neighbor think I set his house on fire? Why would I even do that? I mean, that's crazy. We should call Mikey. Maybe he knows what really happened. Hmm. That's weird. Mikey won't answer me. He usually picks up the phone right away when I call him. Maybe he just didn't hear the call. Fine. Then I'll go visit Mikey myself. Oh, I hope he's home now. Ha ha ha, this house is finished. It's gonna burn to the ground. Hey, stop burning down my house. Who the are you? Ha ha ha, don't you recognize me? I've never seen you before. Stop it. Where will I live if my house burns down? It'll be great if your whole house burns down. Ha ha ha. And then you'd be living on the street. I'm JJ Dark. Remember my name? Where are you running off to? What a rascal. Look at him. He looks just like me. Only he's mean. He said his name was JJ Dark. Is he an evil version of me? It's no big deal. I'll get him again. Let's find him and teach him a lesson. Hands on your head. JJ, you're under arrest for burning down your neighbor's house. What? Are you kidding me? I didn't set his house on fire. I didn't hurt my neighbor. That's why you're holding a bat. You won't catch me. Hey, freeze. You can't run away from us. I told you I'm innocent. If you don't stop, we'll shoot you. Oh no, this is bad. Hands on your head. You're going to stay in the cage until we find out what's going on. Okay, okay, just don't shoot. That's just awful. I don't want to go to jail. Hey, cops, that's not fair. I'm innocent. Where's the proof of my guilt? They won't even listen to me. My neighbor's house must have been set on fire by my evil clone. Oh, Mikey's calling me. Hello, Mikey. JJ, save me. I need help now. Hurry up and come to my house. Mikey, what's your problem? Mikey, are you listening to me? Oh no, why did our conversation stop? I don't know what happened at Mikey's, but he's obviously in trouble. I need to get out of this cage right now. Hey, you two, let me out right now. My friend's in trouble. I have to save him. They don't care about me at all. All right, if they don't want to help me, I'll get out of here myself. Good thing I had my pickaxe with me. Now this cage can't hold me in here. We have to get out of here as carefully as possible. If the police see what I'm doing here, I'll be in trouble. And so, it's like they can't see me. Well, it's their own fault for not paying attention to me. Now I can get out of here in peace. Super, I was able to escape from the cage. Now I have to hurry to Mikey's house. He was probably attacked by my clone, JJ Dark. Don't worry, Mikey. I'll save you soon enough, friend. Oh my God, there's blood. There's blood all over the floor. It's just awful. What the hell happened here? Is that Mikey's blood? Hey, Mikey, you in here? Are you in the house? Oh my God. Oh no, poor Mikey. What happened to you? You're all beat up. Don't worry, buddy, I'll get you out of here. Who would ever think of chaining you up? I'm sorry, JJ, it's all my fault. What? What are you talking about, Mikey? You shouldn't even be talking in your condition right now. You're really hurt. Oh, thank you, JJ. Hanging on those chains was a real pain. Wait a minute, Mikey, I'll get your medicine. Yeah, I could use some medicine right about now. My whole body hurts. I've been beaten so badly. But who? Who could have beaten you so badly? JJ Dark is here to see me. This is the evil version of you, JJ. I knew he did it. Stop, Mikey, how do you know about him? Other people can't tell the difference between him and me. How did you know it wasn't me who attacked you? The thing is, it's all my fault. I'm the one who built the totem and summoned JJ Dark. What? Then we need to destroy that totem. Oh no, the windows are sealed with blocks of obsidian. That's just awful. That means JJ Dark has already come to us. He wants to finish us off. Let's go to the second floor. Oh my god, there's lava flowing in here. He locked us in the house. And now he wants us to burn in the lava. Mikey, get down. I got a pickaxe. I'll break down the wall in your house. Ouch! I accidentally hit the lava. Mikey, why did you even build a totem and summon an evil version of me? I just wanted to be a wizard. Careful, Mikey. JJ Dark, put monsters outside your house. I'm sorry, JJ. I just wanted to learn how to use magic and be like a witch. I just wanted to create a clone of you. I didn't know he'd be evil. We're in so much trouble now because of me. Don't feel bad, Mikey. It's good that you wanted to learn how to use magic. You should have asked a witch for help before you did. Well done, JJ. You defeated all the monsters. Yeah, but we never met JJ Dark himself. 
So since he's out of the way, we should find that totem and break it. I agree. If we break the totem, then JJ Dark should disappear. But I think he'll let us do it so easily. He's obviously going to try to stop us. That's for sure. But I think we can do it because we don't have a choice. We have to beat him. Otherwise, he'll continue to ruin my life. Then follow me. I'll show you where the totem I built is. How far away is the totem? I built it in the woods. Then you'll have to do some running. Oh my god! JJ, look! It's JJ Dark spewing zombies! Ha ha ha! Go my zombie army! Eat JJ and Mikey! JJ, what do we do? Look how many zombies there are! Don't worry, Mikey. If he thinks that's going to hold us up, then he's sorely mistaken. You think we can handle this zombie army? Yes, we're gonna make it, Mikey. Just don't let up. Be extremely careful. We don't even have armor, and we don't have any good swords either. But that's no reason to give up. If we don't defeat JJ Dark today, then we'll never have a chance to defeat him again. It's going to be tough without an armor. Because now zombie blows will be much more painful. And our bat might break. It's made of wood. I agree. This is a real big problem. If our bats break and we're left without weapons, we'll have to fight with our hands. In that case, it will be extremely difficult to defeat such an army of zombies. We're good at fighting zombies. Look at that. There's a lot less of them. Yeah, you can't call them an army now. Now it's just a bunch of zombies. We can easily defeat them. We fought against monsters before, so now we can easily defeat them too. Ha ha ha. Oh no, JJ, my bat almost broke. If this keeps up, then you're gonna have to fight yourself. My bat is only half broken, but don't feel bad, Mikey. Even so, I can beat them single-handedly. Come on, JJ, there's only two of them left. We can do it. I don't know what kind of zombie this is, but they're clearly much more survivable than the regular zombies we see in caves. Even so, we were able to defeat them. Let's hurry up and find the totem. We have to stop JJ Dark. Mikey, is it that the totem? Yes, that's him. Let's break it. Oh, there's an obsidian block. Thanks for giving me your diamond pickaxe. Even so, it's going to take a lot of work. What are you going to do? I won't let you break the totem. Oh my god, you again. You can't stop us. Yeah, you've already made a lot of trouble. We've had enough of your antics. We won't let you bully us. I will personally break the totem and send you back to where you came from. Ha ha ha! You can't break the totem. I won't let you do it. You're so weak you can't even defeat me. I'll finish you off. Don't listen to him, JJ. He's just pretending to be so strong. We can definitely defeat him. But remember, defeating him is not enough. It's the totem that must be broken, otherwise he can be reborn. What? Is all his power in that totem you built? Yes. Then let's do it! Oh my god, Mikey, what's wrong with you? Are you alive? Ha ha, Mikey's done. Now I'm gonna take care of you. You can't beat me. Ha ha ha. You're not happy yet. He who laughs, last laughs well. If your power is in the totem, then I'll teach you a lesson. Then I'll destroy the totem and save Mikey. And how are you gonna do that? You've got an ordinary wooden bat, and it's about to break completely. I have a sharp diamond sword. Admit you can't do it. You and I have many differences, like the fact that I've been in this world a lot longer than you, and I've fought many battles, so no matter how strong you are, I have more combat experience. You haven't even hit me once with your diamond sword. Ouch! Okay, you got me beat, but pretty soon I'm gonna heal myself and come back. You can take all the treatment you want. Once I break the totem, you can't come back. Stop! Don't you dare do that! Ha ha ha! I broke the totem! Victory is mine now! Hooray! I win! Finally, that evil JJ Dark can't hurt me and Mikey anymore. That's right, Mikey, I forgot all about you. Are you okay? Ouch! My whole body hurts. I think he hit me in the head. Hey, JJ, where's JJ Dark? Were you able to defeat him? Mikey, can you get up? Yeah, I can get up. So what happened? Don't worry, Mikey. I beat JJ Dark and broke his totem. He can't hurt us anymore. It's deep into the night outside. Who knew we'd spend so much time on this? Well, I'm glad everything's okay now. I guess we can go home and go to bed. That's a great idea, Mikey. I'm really tired for today, too. But we will need to get our houses in order. Because your house is a little bit flooded with lava. Yeah, that's right. I totally forgot about that. Well, I think we can fix that. 